Hey everyone, welcome back to Sebro. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix Vanguard user mode service high CPU usage. I will be sharing three to four effective solution and I'm very sure that after applying these methods, your problem will be surely fixed. And if this works for you guys, do not forget to like and subscribe. It's absolutely free. And by the end of the video, if you have any doubt, any question, then let me know in the comment section. Okay, so let's get started. What you have to do on your Windows 10 or Windows 11, you need to make a right click on the Windows icon and then choose Task Manager. Once the Task Manager comes up, the very first thing that you have to do, you need to close all unwanted application that you are not currently using. It can be your Google Chrome, it can be your Discord or any other kind of application. Once done, you have to scroll down and you will find a name here, Vanguard Train Notification. Once you get it, you need to make a right click on it and then click on go to details. And then here you will find vgtrade.exe. Right click on it again, go up to set priority and choose it to low. Click on change priority again. And then again, right click on vgtrade.exe. Go up to set affinity, click on it. And here instead of all processor, you only need to give one processor permission. So check one CPU zero and then click on OK. Once done, check back again if the problem has been fixed. Now in case still if you have the issues of high uh, CPU usage for user mode service, next what you have to do, you need to try uninstalling the Vanguard. So for that, first you need to disable the VGC service from your Windows services. So click on your Windows search, type services. From the suggestion, click on services app. And now here you have to look for VGC. So click anywhere and then press the V key. V as in Victor, that is VGC. Once you get it, you need to make a right click on it and then click on stop. Now you have to close it and click on the search box, type here appwiz.cpl. From the suggestion, choose appwiz.cpl control panel item. Now here you have to look for Vanguard. So keep scrolling down until you find Riot Vanguard. Once you get it, you need to make a right click on it and choose uninstall. Then click on yes. And then click on yes again. Once done, you have to restart your computer and next time when the computer comes up, open your Valorant game and then it will show you installing Riot Vanguard. So just wait until it's been done and then again try to play your Valorant game and I'm very sure that your problem will be fixed. Now in case if none of the method work for you, I'm very sure that these methods will surely help you to get rid of this problem but still in case nothing work, then finally you have to go and check for Windows update. So click on the search box, type here update, click on check for updates and again click on check for update and if there are any updates available, kindly go ahead and update it, then restart your PC and after that try using your Vanguard and your Valorant game, I'm pretty sure that your Vanguard user mode service high CPU usage problem will be fixed. So that's all guys for today, hopefully this complete list of solution will give you the fix. And if yes, do not forget to like and subscribe for any question, let me know in the comment section. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.